Hello everyone, and welcome back to Toy Story. So of course this week we are continuing with the Toy Story Toy Box series. Oh, we got the stagecoach coming in. I don't know what it wants or what it's delivering, but okay. Hey, oh, oh come, stop bashing into it, Woody. Stop. Yeah, stagecoach is bashing into everything, so I don't really have a reason to. That is the piano player, and I know that just because just because I played this game so many freaking times, like, I know the names of all the characters, basically. Sheriff, I need your help. No, you don't, Stinky Pete. Oh, and also, this, uh, border around the webcam, I took some inspiration from Turbo Laser Gaming, also known as Ryan. I think it actually looks really good having a border around and, and the logo up there. It was a little bit annoying to actually edit and put into uh, OBS so I can record it, but I think it's worth it. Alright, we got a capsule up here. What is this? Small planter box, which I'm 99% sure I already got. Wait a minute, didn't I build the jail over here too? Did my save file corrupt again or something? I know I saved, but did my jail- what? And also today I took the PSAT, so it was basically like a half day at school, and I took it in person, and it was, uh... Well, that's why it's practice. I've never actually prepped for the SAT whatsoever. I mean, this is a pre this is literally a practice SAT. I never prepped for it. I don't think I even have a need to. Milk bottle hat. Oh, prize caps a collector. I don't really think I have a reason to because I'm going to take the SAT in two years from now. And this is just like a little test to get you more acquainted with it. And I think I am. I understand like the, the time limits and the topics. So I'll be more prepared when I take it in two years. I just don't know what's going on with my save file. That's the weird thing. Maybe Ham is going to tell us to build the jail now. You guys remember on the last episode I built the jail, right? I'm not delusional, am I? <laughs> I swear we built the jail last time. These are the outlaws again. We unlocked this last time. The jail is what we need to stop those outlaws from robbing us. Maybe it just didn't save the last couple of minutes? Because I remember I customized, the, customized this building, this color. And we have the barber shop and the tailor shop. So I think it was just the last couple of minutes of my gameplay last time that didn't save. So let's just build the jail again, which we already did. Uh, we'll put it in the same place we did before, which is right here. I know for a fact we got the jail last time. Taylor shop guy. Wait, is he gonna tell us to bring five bolts of cloth? We did this last time. I swear we did this last time. You guys remember? I'm not sure if you guys remember, but I swear I did this last time. Looks like my audio was clipping a little bit. Maybe I should lower the gain. All right, hopefully the audio is a little bit better now. I'll just smash this box, because why not? What are we even doing? Oh, the, the bolts of cloth, right? Oh yeah, one's right here. Oh, there we go. Another one's right there. Can we actually throw it? No. Yeah, let's get on Bullseye for the last one. I don't remember where the last one was. I think the one on the saloon. Did we get this one? Oh, no, we didn't. There we go. So what? Again, a lot of these missions are kind of a play on words, or they like to put some type of joke in there, in the titles of the missions. Oh, let's get that capsule. Oh, build the jail. Okay, that means they finished the jail right there. And they did. Now, they're celebrating the jail that we already built last time. Sometimes things are big and scary. I think we unlocked the goo last time. Actually, did we unlock Donkey Mountain yet? Sure. No, you guys remember we did this last time. I swear to God we did. You guys remember? I hope you guys remember. Okay, whatever. I guess this is going to be Toy Story Episode 3 repeats. <laughs> I'll try to I'll try to get the missions we already did out of the way, like, so we can get to some new missions. Sorry, Ham. We saw this. You guys remember? I'm not. I'm going to skip it. I consider myself an inspiring politician, and nothing would be more inspiring than seeing my face on every t-shirt wearing citizen in town. Okay, let's put the ham t-shirts on these people again, which we already did. Not haircuts, ham t-shirts. I want to try to unlock the suburbs today, but if my missions keep not saving, then it's kind of going to be harder to do that. By the way, the suburbs, you'll see what I mean by the suburbs. The suburbs, are, suburbs aren't really suburbs, they're, they're sometimes called the outskirts, suburbs, whatever you want to call them. It's just like a little area that's kind of an expansion of the town. But the way that we're gonna unlock it is interesting. Has to do with the outlaws, I'll say that. Well, actually, if we unlock it this episode, you guys will be able to see it anyway. So I don't know why I'm trying to keep it a surprise, but okay. Ham hey, t-shirt and uh, Pioneer. I think the I think the Pioneer wanted a uh, new shirt because did, he's gonna say like, he, oh, I split. oh no, a new hairdo. Why are you walking away from me? You're talking, dude. Dude, why are you walking away from me? We'll give you a new haircut and a ham shirt. How about that? I think that was the same haircut I gave the guy last time, and we might as well give you a ham shirt. There we go. 
And I think we're gonna complete the second mission too now. Ham's mission. There we go. And guys, this episode, I will literally show you me saving. I will literally show you, like, pressing pressing save game. Hey, 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 hey. Yo, yo, yo. Yo, yo, yo. Excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse me. You are going to jail. Should I take should I take him to jail or decapitate him? I'll take I'll take him to jail. Sometimes the outlaws do that. Sometimes they literally start attacking you. Sometimes they attack the townsfolk like that. Sometimes they rob money from the bank. Sometimes they rob money from the townsfolk. Okay, this might be the suburbs, but no, he might tell us to build the bank. Yeah. All right, I'm not even sure if we have enough money for the bank, do we? I'm not sure. Oh no, we could afford the bank. All right, let's buy the bank and uh, let's see, where do we want to put it? Last time we did not get the bank yet, but I think Ham's mission after this is going to be the suburbs. Again, that's the main goal of this episode, to get the suburbs. I think that's a pretty good spot for the bank. And that is how you prep for big construction projects. Do we have any more missions? I mean, no one else has given us a new mission. Oh, uh, Stinky Pete is, but, but let's see. We got the Pictomatic mission and build a bank. Let's talk to Stinky Pete. He's probably gonna make us go on top of Donkey Mountain again. Oh, this again. We did this like two episodes ago. You guys remember that? We did this literally like two episodes ago. You know, I'm not blaming Toy Story. It's an old game. Save corruptions and stuff happens, but you know, we'll just make the best out of them. And there we go. We unlocked the uh, miner who's pro now. Now he's gonna tell and the TNT shack again. I think we even unlocked Sid's Haunted House last time. If you guys remember, last episode I titled it something like, Too Much Stuff at Once. Well, we're gonna get bombarded with all that stuff at once, again, because the save is weird. So, Too Much Stuff at Once Part 2. Actually, I'll probably title this video, uh, like, Finding the Suburbs or something like that, because hopefully we are gonna get the suburbs. That's just what I want to do this episode. I keep talking about the suburbs. You guys, like, don't even know what the suburb is. Oh, building completed. Yeah, I think sometimes they don't have these celebrations for the buildings. Like, sometimes, w once you unlock everything, they're gonna be like, yeah, okay, who cares? We're, we're not gonna, like, celebrate. Oh, okay, dude. Alright, well, the guy is gonna celebrate actually being able to put his money in there. The bank is, like, the only thing that we did this episode that was actually new content. Suburbs, Ham, please give me the suburbs. Oh, Ham, you're gonna get knocked over. Yeah, I warned you, Ham. This freaking stagecoach is brutal. They don't care if you're in the way. Suburbs, please. Those outlaws have blocked off. Oh, yeah, this is the suburbs. We gotta get rid of that water dam. That gate unlocks to the suburbs. And we're actually going to see what is in the suburbs. Okay, let me actually just explain. The suburbs is essentially like kind of a water reservoir and a dam, but like the outlaws built a dam that was like blocking off the uh, water supply and like the actual reservoir itself flooded. So once we go in here, we're just gonna see a bunch of water in there. And now you might be thinking, how is this the suburbs? Well, you see that dynamite up there? Yeah, we are gonna scale all of that, detonate the dynamite, and then this giant rock is gonna fall on that dam and break it open, and this is gonna be all completely new space where we can put a lot more, a lot more buildings and more people are gonna move in, and this is the suburbs slash outskirts. And of course, we do need to do some parkour to get up there. Bright outfit. All right, so we can just smash that over there with that ball. There's actually a lot of uh, dynamite where you need to uh, just bash through there. Also, I don't even think I unlocked the dynamite shack or the TNT shack. I mean, I did unlock it, but I, I don't think I bought it because of the save. All right, this one's a little trickier because you got to go through here, knock this TNT out. Then you got to unlock this platform. And, oh, okay, good save. And you, instead of going over here, you actually need to blow up that little bit. Not blow up. You need to knock down this platform and go through around here. All right, now you got to knock this out. A lot of blowing up stuff. Realistically, I don't know how the dynamite doesn't blow up this actual wooden platform. Outlaws are robbing the bank. If you remember I said before, outlaws do rob the bank, but for frick's sake, I'm not going all the way back just so I can stop them from robbing the bank. Eventually, we're gonna get like a lot of money and when they rob the bank, oh my God, he stole so much. But once we get a lot of money, them robbing the bank is really not gonna be that big of a hassle. All right, more capsules. The more capsules, the better. All right, this is the last TNT or second to last TNT we're gonna blow up. And that is where we started, around there. 
And also, I don't know if you guys remember before, but we got a mission about one or two episodes ago telling us to unlock all the wells. That is the last well we need to unlock in order to complete that mission. It's not the last well we're ever going to unlock, but it's the last well we need to unlock in order to complete that. So watch, we are going to knock this down and watch what happens. And there we go, we unlocked some new characters, and we of course now we have, uh, and we teleport down here, that works. So you can see this is all cleared out now, now there are like animals down here, and the characters, and there's the, there's another mission list over here, there's another toy store there too, there's, there's the other toy store. And now we can just build a lot more buildings, and we can really expand the town a lot now. Well, let's go in this well, I think that might complete the well mission. Or actually, according to this save file, this is the first well that we've been in. Yep, I already explained the well system like twice, so I'm not going to explain it more, but you guys get the point of the well. Now we have this well, which leads up to the suburbs, but the suburbs are currently empty. And the only kind of new major character we get here is Bo Peep. I think she's going to tell us to buy the school, but I'm not going to do that yet because I really have a lack of money. I need to do more missions where I end up earning money rather than spending money. Let me actually customize the bank. There you go, I think that's a pretty good wall. Alright, I think that looks pretty good. And actually, let's customize the jail. I think last time I made the jail look exactly like the town hall. Watch, I'm gonna try to customize, but I'm gonna pick him up. Of course I am. That, that's always the paradox. You wanna pick up, you customize. You wanna customize, you pick up. I think the only change I made was I made the walls that... There you go. And now they match. Do we even have many missions? Okay, the Pictomatic missions. You know what? Maybe we'll do the Pictomatic, Pictomagic mission so we can get the money back that the outlaws stole from us. And more buildings. You know, Ham, we're gonna go bankrupt. You're making me buy, I think, four buildings. You're making me buy four buildings and you're only giving me $750 for that? I, I, I'm gonna go bankrupt. And the well, well, well. Oh, that gives me a thousand. That, this is really easy. The well, 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 because we already have all the wells unlocked. So we can just, all we need to do is just go in the well. Oh, we just watched that crate respawn right in front of us. That's nice. So we, this is the, oh, that's great. This is the stagecoach well, I'm pretty sure. Yes, that was the stagecoach well. Now we got the corral well and the quarry well. Okay, so the game calls it the suburbs because the suburb, the suburbs well, it, it is called the suburbs. But it, it could, it's sometimes, some people in missions are going to call it outskirts. Where's the quarry well? Oh, the quarry well is probably uh, this, like the little mining area. I called it a mining area. Yeah, this. Uh, and then we got the, uh, what's the other well? Corral well. Okay, yeah, that's Slinky's place. So the closest well would be this well. Actually, no, it wouldn't. Okay, great, fine, that works still. All right, we're back at yeah, Slinky's place, but I don't even job. think the farm is there. Oh, the farm is there. Okay, that's good. All right, this is the corral well. Or I would, re I really would just call this, like, the ranch or Slinky's place, but I guess you can call it the corral well. And now we're going to get to the quarry well, which is up here. And I just call this the mining area. Let's get this collectible. All right. And there we go. That's basically a free thousand. Who wouldn't look good driving in one of these babies? You guys remember that from the last episode? Yeah. Also, Conroy is indestructible. See, that works. Where's Bulza? Oh. All right. What other missions do we have? You know what? I'll do the Pictomatic mission, even though I don't like the Pictomatic missions. I think after we do the Pictomatic mission, I'm going to end the video. Also, these are bullseye races. You actually, there are a couple of different races. There's going to be races for the... There's also going to be races for the dragon when we unlock the dragon. There's going to be races for the teeny racer, the regular car. All this stuff might sound foreign to all of you, but we will get there in the series at some point. So let's actually do the race, because I'm pretty sure the race does give you money. And there are a bunch of different bullseye races too, like this one in particular. Alright, get that one. This is not how you... Come on. Dude, there you go. Yeah, there is no way we're gonna get gold. You get bronze, silver, or gold, by the way, depending on your time. We're, we probably got bronze, or maybe bare minimum for silver. 
Also, we're gonna know the last one because there's gonna be like a little star. Which might be this. Yep. Oh, come on, come on, come on, come on. Get up, get up, get up. Get up! Oh my god, bullseye, bullseye. Jeez, what are you doing? Oh, we did get silver. That wants bronze. Oh, bronze is within one minute 30 set. Okay. Prickly pear. Yeah, because I smashed into the cactus with bullseye. Oh, we got 600. All right. Now we're getting somewhere with our money here. Okay, I don't think any of the Pictomatic missions saved, and none of them did. <laughs> Pot pan pandemic. You know, a couple of years ago, I didn't know what the word pandemic meant. And when I realized that, I was like, oh yeah, Pot pan pandemic was the title of the thing. But now that we are going through a real pandemic. Okay, well actually, let's do Pot pan pandemic. I'm pretty sure we need to put pots on three people. So we essentially need to create three crazy daves from... What is the name of that game? Oh my god, Plants vs. Zombies. Which my friend Ryan made a video on, and I think he's making a second one. And he streamed it too. Hello, 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 hello. Actually, you know what? I'm just gonna... No, no, no. We're, we're too broke. Let me just put you in jail. We're trying to scrape up some cash here so we can get more buildings and stuff where is everyone okay i i hope we have the pothead i i hope we do i mean we might not we probably don't but uh let's let's look in our hat shop please tell me there's a pan please tell me there's a pan ah, there's a pan aha uh -huh. we just got to give three people a uh a pot on their head because that's a pandemic apparently but of course there is another pandemic right now that we need to worry about but not in the world of toy story number two Hey, Taylor Shop Guy, Taylor Shop Guy. Pothead and Pictomatic Mission should be complete. <laughs> yeah, that works. So, of course, after every Pictomatic Mission, you have that little cutscene there. And let's do Cactus Field Goal. I don't know if you guys remember Cactus Field Goal, but there are a bunch of different field goals around the map. Basically, if you have a cactus that looks like that, that's a field goal. And we missed. I think we missed the actual first time I did it, too. I mean, we missed the field goal. There we go. There we go. And it says I kicked the townsperson four meters, so that means that this is actually regularly scaled. Meaning we're not like toys, we're basically like a full-size human. I don't know, what, what am I getting into? This is a game. Okay, we'll do Petting Zoo. I'm pretty sure Petting Zoo, I, I, I hope you guys remember, I mean, if you didn't watch the video, you obviously wouldn't remember. We basically just need the cowboy, which, where's the cowboy? There's the cowboy. We need the cowboy and a couple of animals in the petting zoo. There we go. I think we need like a uh, pig and a chicken. Dude, what are you doing? Why are you- UFO, can you give the guy back? I need him for a mission. Okay, the chicken. Are you in there? Go in there. Go in there. Come on. I gotta- I actually gotta do this quickly before the cowboy gets evicted. Okay, we'll put him in last. I think we're good. Petting zoo? Wait, the pig this isn't there. Isn't usually this late. Worried something happened to it. Eh, better go investigate, Sheriff. We will investigate him, but we'll investigate after. By the way, there are a bunch of outlaws stopping it. Let's put a pig in there. Maybe, maybe that's it. Yeah. <laughs> and there we go. So that means we completed three Pictomatic missions, so we get the additional 750. And the gold star. So actually, we are doing a pretty good job escaping together cash. Ooh, would you look at that? 5,000. So we definitely have enough for more buildings and stuff now, but we just gotta... We kind of gotta put our purchases in order of importance. Wait, wait, wait. Actually, actually. Save game. Yes. So I know that I'm not delusional, and I actually did save, okay? And you guys have proof of that. So anyway, that is going to be the actually the, the stagecoach. Uh, so we got a bunch of outlaws here. I'm actually just going to run them over with Bullseye, because I think that, yeah, that does kill them instantly. Whoa. There we go. Of course you could just be a normal person and take them to jail, but... Mm. There we go. The space portal opens a gateway to the galaxies and brings a few destructive friends with it. Get ready for UFOs to rain explosive terror from above. But in a kid-friendly way, you know. Yes, in a kid-friendly way, because that's definitely very important. But all right, that's going to be the end of this video. Hope you guys enjoyed watching. Hopefully, again, the saving works. Let me actually save again, because I unlocked Zerg's spaceport. And there we go. We're good. So thank you guys for watching, and bye.